us who believe in Yeshua, we have the love for both sides. And we don't take sides, we take sides for God. We're Bob and Catherine Carlton. We're filmmakers living here in Jerusalem, Israel. For 30 years, we've been carrying a vision to tell the story of God's peace plan for this troubled part of the world. You know, people are always looking for peace plans, but I think God also has a long-term plan for this region. And His plan is already in place. And it's in place already with a leader. And His name is the Prince of Peace. In Him we are set free to be brothers and sisters. In Him we are set free to be friends and not enemies. We don't need to fight. We have something in common, which is the Messiah, which is much more important than all our differences. To be honest, through meeting uh, my enemy, who turned to be not my enemy, but my brother in Christ, I got to reflect more deeper on myself and the need that I have to forgive and uh, to start a new life of forgiveness and uh, reconciliation. It's very important for my students to know that there are something beyond the wall that is just not the enemy, but actually there are brothers and sisters who may be different than them theologically or politically, and yet they love Jesus and they want to serve Him and, and see their people also be saved. If we're looking to see our world be impacted by the person of Yeshua, He's given us the way. And He said that they may be one as you and I are one Father, that the world may see. You know, a lot of people are looking to us and they're looking to us for an example, looking for us for a model, they're looking for us actually for inspiration. A lot of people have said if it happens in the Holy Land, it could happen anywhere. Because what is going on here, it's not a question only connected to Israel. It is connected to the Kingdom of God. It is important that we start to tell the stories to call the believers, the children of God, to stand in prayer with God's promises and plan, and to pray for a breakthrough in the hearts of Jews and Arabs alike, a breakthrough of God's promises, God's reconciliation, and God's love. I really believe in this project because I believe in making peace. And we need to be challenged to be those who seek after and pursue peace. When God one day will heal the broken family of Abraham, when Jews and Muslims together will receive forgiveness and will be able to see the face of God in each other, they're going to be a living model, a manifestation what reconciliation through God means. They're going to have an impact on the whole body of Christ and on the nations. This is just a taste of the stories we're going to be telling in Peacemakers Crossing the Divide. Arabs and Jews who are living in the midst of conflict and refuse to be enemies. They are the voices of hope. And we invite you to partner with us to help tell these unique stories that you won't hear about in the news Thank you for joining with us to show the world what God is doing to bring about His peace plan for Israel and the nations.